this is my child begging to ride the magic carpet. Hi guys! Welcome to the vlog! Guess where we are. It is what time is it? Or something like that. It's 6.07. We are in the airport and flying home today. I don't know why I can't stop smiling. I've been waiting for this moment so long. It is freezing in New York. If you want to come here, come on your summer, a summer break. It's freezing here. He dropped us off right in front of like where you're supposed to. We had like curbside check-in, so that was great. Um, I love curbside check-in. They don't do it at a lot of airports. But it was freezing. Oh my gosh, the wind was like, it was cold, huh? While you were checking your bag, I literally just turned around and was like, he had like jeans, a long sleeve shirt, and he has a sweater that has fur in it. And I, I knew he was cold, and I was free. Like we walked into the actual airport, and we, we were like shaking, like our teeth were shattering. See, the bad thing is, it was just my face that was cold. Nothing else. The wind will kill you, man. I swear. So we got through security really fast. And um, so that was really good. And you would think that, I don't know, people would know security by now or something, but it was still like the, guy, the guys in front of us were having such a hard time. I kind of felt bad for them because they have to take off like their belts and everything and shoes and and yeah but people in new york you have to use so bins. many bins and like people were running into ryan and he's like won't they say excuse me like literally we were about to go through like the monitor i don't know what you call it, call that thing and this woman is just like like right through my i'm like you could have just gone around me or you could have just said excuse me like what's the point in hitting me if there's other options of getting to your destination that's me you honestly possess me you've made me a gentleman that i feel like it should be expected of everyone that's what that's what what went on good job mom So we made it guys, we're in Charleston and we picked up our car. Now we're driving home. It cost me $84, $84 to park my car for eight days, which I have no idea if that's good or bad. But when I was leaving New York, it said it was $18 a day to park. So I thought that was $10 a day must be pretty good. And so I just stopped to get gas cause I didn't have enough to get home coolest thing gas I paid a dollar ninety nine because I paid my card so I had to pay more which I think is total BS but um by the way but I did pay uh, but if you had paid cash you would have paid a dollar eighty nine I was like what I have not seen gas under two dollars in years like years it was it was so exciting how was your nap on the plane it was amazing they had like pillows and blankets it was a good flight i pretty much slept the whole way there was no like screens on the back of the thing the back of the rest or whatever so he just went to sleep he went to sleep before the flight even took off like he was out and I ended up just going to sleep because I was like, oh, it was only like, it wasn't even technically like a two hour flight. So worked out really good. So yeah, we're on our way home. Are you excited?
Look at this cute thing that they give the little kids at Cracker Barrel. So they could write their Santa stuff. That is actually super cute. But you mailed yours. Yeah, I, yeah, I mailed mine. The best place, right? New York City. So basically, the helicopter is flown in, and the race cars, race car track. And I the get dog, it. The dog has not eaten his food, no food, and it's waiting at the door, just like, love me, love me, come on. And the person is coming up to its home. Pushing all those Legos out was hard. Alright guys, so it is late. I ended up sleeping a bunch this afternoon because I really didn't sleep last night at Six all. Hours. While somebody <laughs> played outside and had a good old time. And then I ended up talking to my mom for a whole bunch and like telling her about my trip and stuff like that. So the vlog isn't like super exciting. But I did unpack my doTERRA stuff I got, and I showed you guys the new boots I got from, um, I got those from QVC, and oh, they were such a good price. I think they were like $27 for those boots, and they're so cute. When was this? And, um, I don't know what you were doing. And we did our advent calendar, and so... We also got the Legos done, four the, days worth. That's our advent calendar. Are you serious? Why didn't you put a Lego calendar? Because <laughs> it's an advent calendar. Oh, you did, when it got here, you just said that it was a calendar that where we punch all the holes out of it 
and we build the Lego on each day. Like if it's the fourth, we punch out the fourth hole. That's all you said. You didn't call it an advent calendar. So now we are looking for something to watch on Netflix. It is really hard. I can't find anything at the moment. And so we're going to watch something on Netflix and go to sleep because it's late and I'm tired. And today was more exhausting than I thought. I should probably sleep at night, don't you think? What else can you do? So I have these huge bags under my eyes. I need to go to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow. And I think we're going to go watch The Flash. See you guys tomorrow. Bye for now.